All right. Let's see if we can finish this damn game. Um, so we were on our way to subvert the glass public public transit system from our favourite place, the lair. Uh, oh, there's another thing on the floor. I don't know why I keep picking these up. It's not going to make any difference. Right, how the hell do we get out of here? Oh. No. No, I'm st stuck on the... Uh-oh. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I'm just walking the same six corridors just the entire game. I did hit that jump button. I promise. Let me readjust this a little bit. Actually put it in front of my face rather than to the side so I don't have to keep leaning over. you expect me to do? Oh, maybe it's a... Uh, one of them. Ah, uh, okay. Yep. Gotcha. I love that I've got a quick turn and I never use it. Apart from when I'm running up walls. Good, a time limit. Damn it. Come on, Faith. sake. already had its things done. What? Okay. 
No, what the hell? Wait, do these move unless you stand on them? Oh, for God's sake. Yeah, this is what this game needed. Right, okay. I've got to wait for that to come up. Oh. Oh, for God's sake. Here you go. Goodbye. Oh, damn it. He's still alive. Oh, for fuck. What just happened? Man, this is getting um, rough. All right, let's try again. fucking thing. Why is that so glitchy? Yep, just climb through the fan. Yep. Right. 
nothing quite like the uh, the exciting fun of waiting for platforms to slowly rise up and down. Whoa, shit! Like, this hasn't been a mechanic through like, the entire game. Why introduce it now? Like, why does this... Why does a moving platform thing exist? Like, this game is... It's really odd, because... There's something about Mirror's Edge that, you know, it tries to create this vision of a world. And it's, it's, it's obsessed with the lore of Mirror's Edge, even though nobody else really cares. They have a real like, love for the world they've created. Um, which is why it's so weird when little things like that just stand out a bloody mile. Like, why does this exist? Who built this? What for? It's kind of like those data node rooms. Like, what purpose does this serve? Not necessarily from a gameplay perspective, because from a gameplay perspective it makes sense, but from an actual story and lore perspective, like you're you're taking your story super seriously. This stuff stands out like a sore thumb. There. Yeah. Right. Oh, so touchy. No, don't fucking wall run off the <laughs> What if I grab the top of that tower and jump from that? Maybe that's a way I can direct myself to the right bit. Apparently I can't find that. Nope, it's not having that. Okay. Ah, 
climb it. Okay, I can just jump it. Right, okay. Overcomplicating it. I'm at the second hub. Connecting. Perfect. I just got us some more time. We'll move on to the last one. Got it. Come on, up. Come on. Okay, just to jump up on that one first. And then I can I say. This is tedious. Right. Up. Turn. Oh, come up. Anything you can't do? Of course. Lots of things. And after all this, I will need to stay off the grid for a while. Everything I do leaves a trace, and sooner or later the grid watch will catch on. Even if they are stupid. That's a lot of enemies. I knew it. Get away from their face. Alright, let's kick them off the building. What are you doing up there? Oh. I was hoping I could hold X there, but that wasn't having it. Ooh, frame rate's starting to take a hit. The game can't handle eight enemies. Frame rate. What's going on? We lost you, babe. Well done. Kuma was afraid you wouldn't make it, but I, I never doubted you. I got more points. More health. Why not? Right, next mission. Where are we? Fast travel to Plastic's Lair. in the main control chamber in the shard. Upload the virus there. It'll permanently corrupt the carrier signal and cause the reflection nanites to go inert. You just need to get to the top. The rest will take care of itself. More or less. Simple, right? Right. 
be the greatest run ever. If I live. Well, there's no time like the present. Any last advice? Don't die. What she said. This is our one chance to nip reflection in the bud. So. Go on, girl. Save us all. Oh, I've got to get to do this path one more time. Oh, a different bit. Uh, bit of fun. We've got a train prepped and ready for you, Faith. Head to the Zephyr Transit Hub and get on board somehow. Somehow. We also disabled the safety override system, so it should be a smooth ride all the way to the Shard. Ah, it's down this way. This is it. You have the virus. Do we need this as gameplay? I mean, this does not look good. Those characters running around inside the shard. Looks like they're evacuating. Only a few. They still seem to think that the damage can be repaired. Stay on the move, base, but watch out for damaged areas. The glass there might be brutal enough to break under your weight. Expect at the top. Expect the control chamber to have some sort of security in place. Oh, I should have wall run. <laughs> Please just start from there. There. Going up. Uh, Here we go. Yeah, close enough. So now they know. They were already at high alert following the bombing. They'd shoot at anything. What can I expect at the top? Expect the control chamber to have some sort of security in place. We've been unable to find its parameters, so you should assume the worst. Wish I could be there with you. Figure they're dropping out of the party. Glad to see you're doing good. I can't wait for your reflection out of my body. It doesn't work like that, Avery. The virus can corrupt the curious signal, which will save the man, but they won't still remain in sight. 
is chilly up here? That's due to the change in air density. I just looked it up. Oxygen content will go down as well, but that's on a serious problem below 18,000 feet. And you won't go that high. What if they shut down the reflection carrier signal before I get there? From what we can see, they still expect the building to remain intact. Some have evacuated, but many remain. You're stupid. Oh, we might be wrong, Plastic. Not a chance. I've done the calculations twice. Plastic, have you ever been wrong? Send in the no. Oh, I lightly bumped into that wall. Oh, that is the door I can open. Okay. This seems like a bad idea. Notar. I've reached the top. Oh, you're going over the side. Bye. Oh no, don't ruin my fun. Bye. No, oh, he just disappears. Maybe he disintegrated. Can't climb that. <laughs> Their firewalls are a joke. My sister could hack through them, and she's even more stupid than Kuma. What the f Their firewalls are a joke. My sister could hack through them, and she's even more stupid than Kuma. Damn it. What? The lot of love. Love and hit by falling debris. This country is not safe and safe. God damn it. Alright. Their firewalls are a joke. Firewalls are a joke. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, there's a thing right next to me. That's what I'm missing. Uh, that one. Oof. And then that one. Cool. This game's just piling on the fun towards the end. Joke. My sister could hack through them, and she's even more stupid than Kuma. Damn it, my drone. This is not stable. Bloody blah 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 blah. Oh, for fuck's sake, that's not the one. 
That was my fault. I'll, I'll take responsibility for that. I'm getting lazy. Hey, the runner vision's back. There we go. I've reached some sort of atrium. Wow. I mean, uh, there's elements of beauty, but these corridors look terrible. I mean, look at this. The rest of the city could use a bit more of this. We need more nature. The, the next glowy bar. Is it that one? We missed that then. There's some serious wreckage here. Oh. Oh, good. A sound recording all the way up here. Oh, I don't like this much. Builds a building this tall anyway.
where do you want me to swing to? Okay, over here. I feel, the, I feel my stomach going every time I do that. This is unpleasant. How did that glass go through the glass? Is it going to stop breaking if I walk slower? Nope. <laughs> uh, oh. Back on myself. What do you want me to do? Do you want me to walk along there? Oh, you really want me to do that? Kuma wants you to be careful, Faith. I mean, hey, you guys. Whoa. There's a huge hole in the wall here. The explosion tore off one of the burrow plates. Is that a bag out there? I'm trying to open the elevator doors for you, but see if you can find another rock in the meantime. It's got a question about it. Why is that out there? Oh shit. I bloody knew that was going to happen. <clears throat> More climbing. I probably shouldn't compl complain about climbing and Mirror's Edge. It's, it's a bit like complaining about shooting in Call of Duty. Stop shooting at me, you pricks. Ah, for fuck's sake.
keep moving. Alright, don't rush it. There we go. More climbing. the top. Quite a view up here. That's it, I give in. You are the better runner, Faith. Get the secrets. The console will launch the command center just below you. I'm here. There's a console here. That's it. Connect the Omnistat drive and the virus will do the rest. And you should probably expect some guards to show up. As I suspected, what do you hope to accomplish here? I'm giving people the right to decide things for themselves. Oh, Faith, hasn't it ever occurred to you that people might want reflection? They just want the pretty lie you're giving them, not the ugly truth. Oh, yes, the truth is always ugly, isn't it? As you should know. It's your mother's work that you intend to wreck, after all. She never wanted this. You perverted everything she ever stood for. What do you know of her reasons? You were a child. You're still a child, wantingly destroying everything around you. I promised your sister that I would capture you alive. Submit, and you won't be harmed. Never. It's gonna be harmed then. Luckily, I have the secret power, which is back and Y, X and X, and back and Y, and X and X. Oh, keep it my fun. Yes, it's real fun fighting two of these guys at once. All right, he's done with. I mean, is this techno from like the late nineties? Oh, good. We're going to fight this guy now. I should have had you killed with your leech parents. You've lost Kruger. Your control ends here. Reflection is not about control. It's about survival. For you and the other families, maybe. It's time you all withered and died. By destroying Reflection, you're dooming your dear sister as well. I'm setting her free. Hardly. Isabel has a chronic lung condition. With reflection, we've managed to keep it at bay. Destroy You're it. You're lying. Am I? Am I lying? You almost managed to kill her once. Why not just go finish the Stay job? Back. Everyone around you dies, Faith. Did it ever occur to you that maybe you're the one to blame? You killed my family. You killed my friends. And you killed Noah. What the hell are you waiting for? Stop that thing and kill her. Cat. What? Cat, stop! Cat, talk to me.
Oh, glad they had this crash mat here. Are we going somewhere slightly more appropriate for a boss fight? He says cynically. Cat! Stop it. She pounced like a cat. Do what I say instead. This is going on long enough. Fire! No, no, no! You can help get her up. And that's how it all went down. You're kidding me! That's the end of the game? Though the employees rose up in disgust over reflection and overthrew the conglomerate. But there was no mass uprising. No riots on the streets. Krugersek remained in control. Life went on as before. Or almost. Because something had changed. We'd started something. <laughs> Did something they? We intend to finish. Oh man, they really thought they were going to get a sequel to this. Wow. That's uh, yeah. That's a thing. Jesus Christ. Okay, I guess uh, I guess let's take it over to the to the list and see see where we're looking. Um, it's been a while since I've looked at the list actually, because it's been a little while since I finished the inpatient in my time. Um, so let's do this. So, where do I think this goes on the list? Well, let's sum up Mirror's Edge Catalyst first. Uh, I don't think it's a good game. I don't even think it's a mediocre game. I, I genuinely think it's a bad game. I'm kind of shocked that it's got a 72 on Metacritic. Um, because it feels... Yeah, it, it just doesn't... I guess it shows the difference between 2016 and now. I feel like if this came out now, it would be getting much lower. 
kind of um or obviously it would because it doesn't look like a 2020 game but you know what i mean in terms of expectations for this sort of game have changed and they were different then so it's uh it's a bit of a challenge i think for me i it definitely doesn't fall into any of these top six so anything from silent hill homecoming up to kills in shadowfall i think are safe the question then becomes how much further down the list do you go and the getaway black monday is always that break point it's always the point where i'm like ah oh, i don't the getaway black monday is not a good game but you know it it did a it was trying to do something on a mod, a modest budget because they had spent so much money making the first game and it was running on old tech and at some point it did try and do something different so i don't know like fable anniversary the reason it's that far down the list is partly because the game is aged but partly because the the xbox 360 version running on xbox one was totally broken um and for the record the xbox one version of mirror's edge catalyst kind of broken kind of not solid considering that game came out over four years ago it's pretty ropey and it's not like i'm running it on an xbox one x or a series x which just isn't out at the time that i'm recording this i'm recording this on a basic like bought in 2014 as a titanfall bundle xbox one so this is the kind of hardware you would have run this on at the time so i'm kind of tempted to go below the get the getaway i'm kind of tempted to go below fable anniversary dead to rights i didn't enjoy dead to rights but i did have more laugh oh, I, don't, see, I had quite a lot of laughs at the um the combat <laughs> which was uh hysterical i feel like maybe it goes below the impatient of the inpatient, not the inpatient. That's a very different game. Um, just a lot of people kind of pace in the room. Because I don't... Something about it just doesn't click for me. It doesn't... I didn't have fun playing it. I didn't get anything out of the, the story. Um, the story was taking itself way too seriously. And without anything to kind of back it up with i suppose yeah i don't think secret see secret service is the is the part where the, i feel like this list is starting to get into sections where you kind of got you know high quality games that just lost their way a little bit you've got high quality games with problems and then you've got bad games and Secret Service and Soldier Fortune are the break point between the good and the bad. <laughs> um, so I think it sits in the mundane section. I do think the impatient is more interesting. So I'm going to take all of this, move it down there. And I'm going to put Mirror's Edge Catalyst in 11th place, which if you'd have told me that, before I started doing this, I would have been very surprised. But, um, oh, it's not, why is it not updating? What's going on here? Nope, this doesn't work. This doesn't work at all. <laughs> Great. Hang on, two seconds. There we go. <laughs> this is such a crappy way of doing this. Um, yeah, 11th place. I surprised as anybody um, and you know compared to Battlefield Hardline which people had a harder time with I think I would much rather play that than this so color me surprised because like I say if Mirror's Edge 1 was on this list it would be number 1 probably so there you have it that was Mirror's Edge Catalyst and uh, the credits are still rolling <laughs> And the Xbox controller fell across the room, so I can't press the button to make it stop. Hmm. 
Maybe I can try and grab it. Hang on. I mean, we're pretty much done. I, I just... I'm not expecting some big reveal. Joanna Kruger, CEO. Oh, hello. Kruger Holding, today announced the successor to Gabriel Kruger, having Kruger stack and missing since the terrible events in Glass recently. Kruger will be superseded by his daughter, Isabel, who, while still mourning her... Well, I have to go. Your sister's the new head of Kruger sec. Mm. Interesting. Plastic made a breakthrough with Kuma. <laughs> I'm off. I am sure glad to be rid of that crap. That's one I owe you forever, Faith. So. What are you gonna do next? I'm gonna run. Oh, can I drop this game further on the list? Oh, at least she just dumps you straight back into the. So is it is it really your sister? Cool. Well, that was Mirror's Edge Catalyst. Uh, I'm gonna stop playing this. Because, <laughs> uh, yeah, it's not. Not that much fun. Um, yeah, cheers for joining me. And uh, next time we'll play something different. Uh, maybe we'll play something a little bit older. I don't know. I should have a think. But um, yeah, this is kind of a nice palate cleanser from all the shooters. Um, although, to be honest, it's been a while since we had a first person shooter because we did Silent Hill and The Impatient. So maybe we go back to one of those. Who knows? Anyway, I'm rambling. Thank you. Catch you next time.